My name is Alex and I'm going to show you how to make something look partially submerged in water in Photoshop. So here I have a stock photo of uh, some ocean and I'm going to take this word and make it look partially submerged in water. So the first trick is you're going to want to erase some of it. So I'm going to take my eraser tool and actually I'm, uh, the first thing I should do is uh, right click my type layer and rasterize it so that it's directly editable. And then I'm going to go and use a softer brush to erase with, like this. And actually, I'm just going to hold down Shift, like that, and just erase the rest of it. As you can see, now everything is kind of gone. So then what I'm going to do is I'm actually, I'm going to go ahead and take some more of that. And I'm going to drop the opacity a little bit to probably around 50, 60 percent, and then I'm just going to go ahead and do that one more time across so that it, you can see the water details. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually copy this by holding Option and just pull it, and I'm going to free transform that copy, flip it vertically, and then I'm going to put it right here, and then I'm going to say OK, and then I'm going to actually make the opacity really, really low, so like 34% probably. So that way when you zoom out, it looks like it's partially submerged in water and it's reflecting on the surface so that it actually looks like it's actually sitting there and not just kind of photoshopped in. My name is Alex and this is how you make something look partially submerged in water in Photoshop. Thank you.